What's happening? Hello world, this is Johnny DeLuca and welcome to your 14th SQL Server tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create your first non-clustered index using SQL Server Management Studio and showing you how to do the same thing using a T-SQL script. So to get started, please connect to an instance of SQL Server, then go to the Databases folder and expand that. Go to AdventureWorks 2012, expand that. Go to the Tables folder, expand that. Now we're looking for sales order header table, so we're going to scroll on down. Uh, and it's already open. All right, cool. Um, we're going to right click the Indexes folder, and we're going to go New Index, Non Clustered Index. Then we're going to give this a new name right here. We're going to call this ix underscore, oh, not ix, ix underscore sales order header underscore order date. All right, date. Looks good. ix underscore sales order header underscore order date. From there, we are going to click the Add button. And now, we're going to go over here to the Order Date and click that guy. Now, we're going to click OK. And we're going to click OK again. And we're done. Now, let me show you how to do the exact same thing. Uh, running a T-SQL script. As always, copy this down. Save it. You can use it later. Now I would just hit execute and that would accomplish the same thing. I'm not going to do so because I've already done this previously and I'll get an error saying, hey, you can't do that because you've already done that. But since you haven't done that, it'll say command completed successfully. And now you know how to create a non-clustered index using SQL Server Management Studio as well as using a T-SQL script. Thanks for watching this tutorial. I look forward to seeing you in my next tutorial.